Hi guys, it's Mike here from Trailer Tech. Today we're at the Gold Coast Studio in Burley Heads just to showcase our ultimate Trady Pack Builders trailer and help you guys understand what it's all about. The idea behind this build was to try to fill a gap in the tool trailer market. There aren't many options for you guys between a basic tool trailer costing between 10 and 15K and then going up to a full custom build which can easily go over 30 grand. All right, so up front we've got a 50 mil coupling and a seven pin flat connector for your trailer lights. Um, the trailer also includes an Anderson cable, so you get a 50 amp Anderson cable. Um, you don't have to use that, but it's a great feature if you want to add a bit of charging power to the dual battery system. Uh, jockey wheels included, and we've got a front ladder rack here. The ladder rack is 1300 mil wide, and up front we've got a full size spare and a spare tire mount. Uh, some people have decided this is a great spot. You remove the spare tire mount, you mount the tire somewhere else, and it's a good spot for fitting a compressor. So with the front box, it's draw bar mounted. The um, front box is approximately 700 mils wide. It does include a fridge slide, and the fridge slide is suitable for fridges up to about a 70 liter capacity. Uh, we do a package with an ARB Zero 69 liter dual zone fridge, fits quite nicely on here. Uh, this front box does have power independent to the rest of the trailer. So you can have a fridge in here running all the time with a separate uh, direct power source to the battery. And that'll make sure your fridge stays running while you power off the rest of the trailer. So now into the main body. The main body is eight by five or 2.4 meters long. Um, we've got three doors in the main body. All three doors have reinforced plates for stiffness. And also the whole trailer has a matching whale tail T-handle. Um, inside the door, you will see there's some LED lighting. Uh, the handles themselves are all controlled via these remotes. So simply your one, one push in, the trailer's unlocked. Uh, and one push and the trailer is all locked and armed. Um, this is also the area where we have our main control board. So we've got a switchboard for all our 12 volt system. So that's gonna turn on the lights. Also, it's gonna turn the water pump on. And then we've got a gauge to let you know how much water's in the tank. It's about a 90 liter water tank. Next along is this remote. This is to power up our inverter. So we've got an inverter fitted in this box here. The trailer is basically set up as a mobile power station. So you've got 150 watts of solar on the roof through a solar charge controller. Uh, that's sending power to a dual battery system, 200 amp hours of batteries. And then we have an inverter, 2000 watt inverter in this box. And uh, the inverter is basically uh, ready on call to power up the GPO up here. And then we've also got a 10 amp outlet here. So we like to leave the majority of the main body open for you guys to fit different things where you'd like. We do put a couple shelves and drawers here on this side. So we do have two uh, toolbox drawers here, a couple shelves, and that's basically it for this side. Uh, coming around to the back, uh, we've got a 90 liter water tank, sits underneath the back axle. Actually helps a bit when the tank's full with removing a little bit of uh, tongue weight off the tow bar. Um, we do a full length rear roller here as well. Um, so that's gonna help with fitting long lengths. Uh, inside the back of the trailer, more LED lighting. We've got a couple shelves, good for screws and different tools. Our tail lights are a, uh, we've got a lower tail light assembly here. We've also put the tail lights in up higher. So you get a lot more visibility. It's much safer at night. Uh, the drawers are 1800 long. Uh, they're on the heaviest slides we could possibly fit on a drawer this length. So they're about 150 kilos load rated. And then come around, let's have a look at the other side. So we've got a, a ladder here, which is standard. And coming into the side, which is the street side, we've got a very large open cavity basically for you guys to fit how you'd like. Uh, you can fit a 2.4 meter long level through here, uh, straight, not on an angle. Uh, there's some more storage down in here as well. And then the other side of the front box is a couple shelves. So now down to the wheels and tires, we have a 16 inch alloy wheel 
and the tire is a 265-75-16 light truck tire, basically a 31 inch tire, so it's quite a beefy wheel and tire package on this trailer. It's mated to a Land Cruiser hub, 12 inch electric brake on every wheel, and a 50 mil uh, solid axle. The suspension's three and a half ton rated leaf springs with a roller rocker assembly. All in all, the whole package is just under 2.2 meters wide. As you can see, the trailer represents great value for money. We've got finance options also available, pretty quick turnaround time, so give us a call or send us an email if you want some further info. Cheers.